In the past, Phuket was one of Thailand's commercial ports which traded with other countries. These cultural influences are reflected in the cuisine and local foods. Phuket cuisine and local food is the combination of many cultural food habits, whether they be Chinese, Malay or Thai. Some Phuket local food tastes sweet, such as Chinese Hakka cuisine, but it can also be spicy, such as in Thai cuisine and Malay cuisine. <laughs> Dishes and foods Ah <laughs> Pong <laughs> If Oaew is the signature desert of Phuket, Apong can be considered to be the signature snack of Phuket. Apong snacks are easy to make as the ingredients flour, egg yolk, coconut milk, sugar, water, and yeast are readily available. All these ingredients are mixed together and made into a pancake. With a delicious, light sweet aroma from coconut milk, Apong is a popular snack for all ages of people in Phuket. Anggu Anggu is a popular snack eaten during the auspicious ceremony of Phuket. From Chinese belief, turtles are the symbol of eternity so they believe that those who eat this snack will live endlessly like the turtles. This snack is made from glutinous rice flour, vegetable oil, sugar and gold nuts. Because of the sweetness of the gold nuts, people usually eat it as a snack with coffee or tea. Bi Pang Bi Pang is a crispy rice cut into a solid rectangle with sweet sauce. It resembles a nutrition bar. Bi Pang is made from puffed rice mixed with the fried garlic topped with sweet sauce to blend with the salt from the rice. People in Phuket usually eat this with tea in the afternoon. Gong Som Bla Gong Som Bla is a popular local fish curry dish in Phuket prepared using a curry paste. It is prepared without the use of coconut milk. <inaudible> Oaew Oaew is a very famous desert of Phuket, and it originates from Phuket. Oaew is made from jellied banana flour mixed with boiled red beans, ice and sweet red syrup extra jellies and fruit is also added to make it sweeter and more flavorful. People who come to visit Phuket must try this because this is the signature desert of Phuket town. Bigomwa <inaudible> <inaudible> Bigo Moi is a snack made of black, wet sticky rice with coconut milk. The point that this desert fascinating is the texture and flavor of the black sticky rice, which is glutinousness and has saltiness from the coconut milk. Kanam <coughs> Jin Kanam Jin is a noodle dish made from rice or fish and is topped with sauce. There are many sauces to eat with Kanam Jin, such as Thai PLA sauce, Nam Frik sauce and Namia sauce. In Phuket, people usually eat it for breakfast with fried pa tong go and curried fish Moreover, kanam jin in Phuket comes with more than 10 kinds of fresh vegetables which give it the identity of kanam jin Phuket. Lo ba Lo ba is deep fried pork organs served with fried tofu and spicy sweet sauce. Some restaurants have more than one kind of sauce. Topic: <laughs> Mi Hoon Pa Chong. Mi Hoon Pa Chong is one of the favorite dishes of local people. It consists of noodles fried in soy sauce, topped with fried onion and taken with pork soup. The recipe was originated by Pa Chong, so local people call the dish Mi Hoon Pa Chong. O Dao O Dao is a famous hot dish in Phuket. O Dao, is a fried oyster or seafood dish prepared with eggs, flour, bean sprouts and taro root. 
It can be seasoned with salt, sugar, chili or vinegar. In addition, people usually eat it with bean sprouts and crispy pork. O dao is one of the ancient dishes of the area. Topic: <laughs> Pad Thai. Pad Thai is a local stir-fried Phuket noodle dish prepared using a unique curry paste. The curry paste typically contains chili peppers, tamarind, shrimp paste and sugar. Topic: <inaudible> Mu Hong. Mu Hong is a stewed pork dish. It is originated by Chinese people called Hokkien who came from neighboring countries which are Malaysia and Singapore. They usually made this dish in general ceremonies. Mu Hong contains pork belly, which is the main part of the dish. Pork can be used from another part of pig's body to balance the ratio between meat and fat, as pork fillet for low fat or pork loin for a little bit of fat. Mu Hong also contains dark soy sauce and sugar for sweet taste and unique texture, garlic, pepper, and coriander roots for black peppery flavor. Light soy sauce for more salty taste. Finally garnished with fresh coriander. Mu Palo is similar to mu hong but mu palo contains Chinese five spice. To make mu hong, strong stewpot is required with medium heat, and to be simmer for two to three hours. If it is too dry, try to increase the amount of hot water during the process. Mu hong is usually served with rice or boiled rice and served as the main meal. See also List of Thai dishes List of Thai ingredients List of Thai restaurants <laughs>